Benton Harbor schools are having major money problems. The superintendent says the district is more than $15 million in debt. The state board decided Benton Harbor area schools are in probable financial stress. Now, the school board will have to make a decision now on how to resolve the issue. The Michigan Department of Treasury says the district can either choose a consent agreement, have an emergency financial manager come in, or have a neutral evaluation done or even file for bankruptcy. The board's findings have been sent to the governor. The next step in the Public Act 436 process would be for the governor to appoint a review team to take a, uh, a deeper dive, if you will, into the school district's finances. The superintendent says they will likely choose a consent agreement because it will give the district more time to pay off the debt. The man who